Welcome to Medicine Handy Point. Today we will discuss decompressive craniotomy for ischemic stroke. So in ischemic stroke, we can do it. Let's quickly go through it. It is actually removal of a part of cranium to relieve the intracranial pressure developed as a result of ischemic stroke. So it is done ideally within 48 hours of onset of ischemic stroke, but it cannot be done in all the patient. There is some criteria uh, and the patient has to fulfill that. So the criteria has four points. Patient age should be ideally less than 60 year of age. So the patient should be younger than 60 year old. There should be clinical feature of MCA territory stroke on examination. So we can detect there is a MC territory stroke. Then the patient should be having depressed level of consciousness. It cannot be done in alert awake patient. So depressed level of consciousness should be there. CT should be showing more than 50% MCA territory involvement. Only then we can proceed with decompressive craniotomy for ischemic stroke. It helps some patient, but exact data is not available about the effectiveness, but some patient can get help if the criteria is fulfilled. I hope it will help you. Please like the tutorial.